Hey guys, I'm Lee. I'm here today with SoFresh at Lomography in London. We're going to be finding out about their new camera, the Constructor. It's a completely build-it-yourself analog SLR. So we're going to go inside and find out a little bit more about it. So we're looking at the Constructor today. Ours are fully built. We've got working ones here. I guess the first question for you really is how much does it cost? It's £29. So, I mean, in comparison to some of your other cameras, that's quite reasonable, isn't yeah. it? Um, and what would you say the main reason for buying one of these would be? Uh, probably it's it's quite fun to build uh, and at the end of it you get a really great little SLR camera. It's quite classic so it's going to give you um, a really nice kind of classic effect. Is this the best way in? Yep. It's pretty much everything you need laid out. The whole thing is plastic, apart from the screws. There, there have already been people, if you go onto our website, you can see people have been kind of modifying it and turning cool. things around. But people have a challenge. What kind of film can you use in it? Um, it takes 35mm film and so you can use any kind, black and white slides, any kind of brand and you can um, come in store and drop your films off and get the process with us yep. or you can do it online if you don't live near London you can post your films to us we'll process them and post them back to you. Is that expensive? No it's um, if you wanted um, your images on a CD it's eight pounds per roll. At the moment it's it's fixed so you will be able to put any other lenses on right, okay. but uh, lamography we do like to bring out new designs and things yep. like that so who knows there might be something in the future. If you wanted to shoot in low level, like you can put a higher speed film in so you okay. can put up an 800 or a 1600 if you were shooting yeah. at low levels of light. Would you say this camera then going on that is for an amateur, mediocre or professional photographer? Um, it's kind of across the board really. If I mean it's good for someone who wants to try an SLR out, um, you know it's a good starter camera yeah. but then a professional can use it as well. We watched it put together online in about 20 minutes which seemed phenomenal. How long can people be expecting to take at home the average person? Uh, it should take about an hour. About an hour, yeah? Hour and a half of tea breaks. It'd probably take me about three days I was saying earlier. <laughs> cool, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to have a look and maybe take some photos ourselves and uh, see how that turns out. First world problems on the camera, not being able to afford £29. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it. Lee's view of the day, bump the train, buy a film, get one of these, have some fun. Don't bump the train.